If you haven't subscribed already, ring that bell to get notified when new movies are posted. Hey, Chris Young here from HomeKit Geek, the channel where we bring you new smart home content every week from Apple HomeKit, from Amazon's Echo, Madam A, Google Assistant, Home Assistant, as well as a lot of videos on air quality. So today we're going to be looking at the AirDog AirFit, and I'd like to say thank you for AirDog for providing me with this unit. Really appreciate that. This is a really interesting um, device in a class of devices that we're going to start to see more and more of as the air quality um, A becomes worse and B as we become more aware of how air quality actually impacts our lives. So this is a personal air purifier that you could literally take with you to work. You could strap it on your arm, walk around with it. You can even put on the mask. Now, whether or not you actually want to put on the mask, well, that's a whole different question. But if you're suffering from allergies, if you live in a place where the air quality is horrible, this literally might save your life. Let's take a look. So spring is here and so is allergy season. The AirDog Fit Air is a personal air purifier that has multiple modes that's going to help you deal with that. This is a Bluetooth device, lithium ion battery. It charges from USB. It'll run for two to six hours depending on the speed of the fan, 130 liters per minute, which is pretty amazing considering the average human, according to the website at least, does somewhere between 15 and 20 liters a minute. This will clean about 25 square feet area around you, and like I said, multiple modes. So you've got the uh, multiple, the, the stacked mode, which you're seeing on the screen right now, where you could put this in your car, you could put this on your desk and clean the area around you. You also have uh, the running or the moving mode. And in this mode, the, the fit air actually breaks apart and goes into this holder where you got an arm strap or you could strap it to a stroller or, or something like that. And for really, really, really bad uh, air quality, you've actually got the full on what I like to call the Darth Vader mode, which is full mask. And you can see with this, there's actually a tube that connects to the, the um, outside of the fit air and allows you to put on that mask saves you from all the pollen allergies, PM 2.5, all that dirt in the air, and really lets you get just clean air quality. Let's take a look. Small box, the Fit Air, your ultimate personal air purifier. So this is not the first air purifier that AirDog has made. They've actually got a, a few different models and are not just doing air purification, they've actually got a heater as well, which is kind of nice. And as you can see here, it's I'm not sure how I feel honestly about the the aesthetic of it. The, it's shiny with that kind of dull plastic. Um, you, you know, it's uh, I, I personally I think it's a little flashy, right? Uh, so maybe that's your style. That's great. Um, for me, I would have rather that the the chrome here. If this is something I'm wandering around with, I really would have liked to maybe have like a black or um, something just a little bit. A less less stated so when I'm walking around in public but then again if I'm wearing a mask anyways you know maybe that's not that important so as we go through here you can see here that we have uh, the instructions the micro USB uh, as well you've got a extra HEPA purifier so that's gonna be we'll show you where that goes in a, in a few minutes but this is one of those things that you're gonna have to replace as time goes by all right in its default state um, you're looking here at kind of the running mode with that the armband locked onto it and just by simply twisting it you can twist them together and create that kind of um, standalone state right the standalone mode which is really nice so here's I as I kind of twist off the cap here you can see that you've got kind of the battery and, and um, fan and on the other side which is the actual purifier side that is where we've got that little um, the little purifier the the filter itself so that is going to be something you're going to have to replace over time uh, depending on at least according to the website that could be anywhere from two to four months for a purifier really depending on how dirty the air is as you're walking around taking a quick look at the website they were not that expensive I think it was about uh, thirty dollars for a pack of five so not that bad so if you really have bad air you may want to invest in the Fit Air accessory kit as well, which is the the mask and the tube and or the Darth Vader mode, as I like to call it. So you can see that in the in the box here comes this kind of extensible 
plastic tube and this essentially this is going to connect to a air mask and although they do have the air masks that they sell here you could according to the instructions at least buy your own air mask so if you've been to china and you've seen some of those hello kitty or, or uh, custom air masks that's a possibility as well that you can just cut out the hole just a little bit smaller than the filler piece and you're going to be able to use whatever mask you'd like to so getting this out of the bag here, you can see you've actually got a an exhaust vent on one side and on the other side you've got this pre-cut hole that the connection for the hose is going to go right into that hole. So we'll get this opened up here. There we go. And you can see that the end of the hose, if you look carefully here, has these little connections in it and that's just going to snap over and kind of form an air seal there and essentially what's going to happen is the air fit is going to push air out of the air fit up the hose and we're going to be good to go um so i've actually got this on the wrong side here we're going to go into the other side and there's that little you can see it's circular already been cut out so we're just going to kind of tear those out let's get those out of there We're going to remove the hose and then we're just going to slide in the piece as you can see it's slightly bigger on the back side than the hole in the mask itself so that's going to really kind of help to make sure we've got a little bit of a seal here and that we're not bringing in or at the least amount possible we're not bringing in much dirty air now we simply slide this into the base unit and uh we get charged and that's it we now have we can walk around and uh, basically with this air mask, even if you've got really super dirty air, you've got pollen all over the place, you've got whatever it happens to be, this should help you uh, considerably. So you may notice in the video, I'm having a little bit of trouble getting this in. Um, that's actually because this is shaped to really get a tight seal there. And so the, the, um, the coupler itself has to be spun at just the right angle. But once you've got that done, you're, you're in for some quality air. So let's go over to the phone app now, get this thing charged up and connected and see what we can see uh, in the smart portion. So here we are in the AirDog Fit Air, and you can see landscape mode only. I recorded this on my iPad, but frankly, I'm not going to dock AirDog any points for landscape mode only because you're probably not going to be walking around with your, your uh, iPad. You're probably going to have this connected to your phone. So once you get this connected, it's a really sleek, streamlined interface. You can see how much of the filter is remaining, how much of the power level is battery. You can see um, how much of cumulative particle removal was done in the last 10 hours. Turn it on or off. You can set the airflow mode to uh, to high speed in one of the three modes. And of course, up on the top right hand corner, you could press the kind of pair button and delete it if you so chose, which I don't. I don't want to do that. Um, that's really it. So what do I think about the AirDog Fit Air? Well, I think air quality is critically important. Um, you know, there, there is, this has been said a lot, it's not mine. You can survive days without food, or weeks without food, days without water, but you can't even survive minutes without air, or at least most people can't, right? So I love the fact that there are starting to be more products on the market from vendors who actually get this, manufacturers who get air quality, like AirDog. Um, it's a really interesting product. Do I see a lot of people picking this up, putting that mask on and walking around all over the place? No, I don't, right? It's, uh, it's, it's not a fashion statement that a lot of people want to make, you know, that's, uh, and I'm fine with that. But for the people who have really bad allergies for areas where the air quality is absolutely horrible, you know, parts of China, Beijing, India, this might actually literally be a lifesaver. Right, that it's going to help make sure that you don't end up with all those impurities in the air going straight into your lungs and straight into your body. So, if you guys got any questions, please put them below. You know what to do. I'll get to them as quickly as I can. Subscribe if you haven't already. I would really appreciate that. Like, shares, appreciated. And we'll see you guys next time.